what, what the mate is talking about. Yeah. What's up, family? LeBron James' support for Ahmaud Arbery, the black man who was killed by a couple of white supremacists in Georgia as he jogged, has rubbed Fox Sports' number one slave, Jason Whitlock, the wrong way for some reason. LeBron wrote on Twitter, We're literally hunted every day, every time we step foot outside of the comfort of our homes. Can't even go for a damn jog, man. Like, what the F? Man, are you kidding me? No, for real. Are you kidding me? I'm sorry, Ahmad. Rest in paradise. And my prayers and blessings sent to the heavens above to your family. Jason Hamhock, one who has never missed an opportunity to promote himself, seized the opportunity to pounce on LeBron by making a bizarre Michael Jordan comparison. This isn't helpful, he replied. It's Twitter trolling. It's using this man's tragedy to build a brand as more outspoken than Michael Jordan. There are all kinds of ways to draw attention to this tragedy. Suggesting that we are hunted every day, every time, is just shit stirring. No, stinky boy. You are shit stirring. As you always do. Especially in regards to black men especially successful black men, black men that play sports, something that you has never been able to do. You've never been capable of playing sports on any type of level. You, Jason Whitlock, are a sucker, a clown, a failure. Okay, you got a show on Fox. They always give the sellouts something. From the time Jason Whitlock got his first gig as a reporter at the Charlotte Observer, he's been a sellout. He showed them that he can throw black people under the bus with more frequency than they ever desired. That's what he does. There's a few others out there just like him. That's what they do. Their whole hustle is demonizing black folks, specifically black males. That's what they do. LeBron James used his platform to make people aware of a very important issue, a very important social issue, something that Michael Jordan appeared to be incapable of doing. He never did. That's honorable. And you can't stand it because you're dishonorable. People like LeBron because LeBron is not selfish like you. He knew making that post was going to cause him some type of social equity, perhaps even financial equity, but he did it anyway because he stand for something unlike your wobbly ass. Jason Whitlock, your mama should be embarrassed and your daddy should have pulled out. No more talk. What the talking about?